morning loves it is Madi from namaste Madi, and it is monday morning rumbles kind of excited this monday morning not really sure actually i am sure why i had a really good week in terms of workouts and like balanced eating usually on saturdays it's my treat meal and sometimes the treat meal goes overboard to like a treat weekend but i planned it out um I've been reading a book, I don't want to say the title yet because I don't want to promote it until I finish it completely, but it's about just finding balance and binging and stuff like that. So far, I like it, so that's that, so that's thumbs up. Um, but then, I started reading this book and I kind of put this in the back burner, but I decided to try to find, again, balance, so I'm committed to finishing this book. I am restarting. Last week was the week of relationships, if you remember I told you that, and I decided to restart it because I did it last week for like three days. Where is my shake? I'm thirsty. Did I not bring... Oh, it's up there. Damn it. Anyways, I was just thirsty, but um, I started it, and then I think around maybe three or four days into the week, I just stopped. Not because I wasn't into it, but just because... I wasn't, I was in my own little personal thing last week, but I'm finding balance again. I should just take, name this blog balance, this Monday morning rambles, but no, um, so yeah, I'm committing to finishing this. Today is again week, day 22, part two, since I'm doing it all over again. And yeah, so we'll see how that goes. I, I really want to finish this and then I want to finish the other book that I'm reading maybe I can try you know what it is I have ADD people I don't know if I told you this I have ADD and I guess it's coming into play right now with the books that I'm reading because I want to finish one book but I want to go back to the other book maybe I'll carve out time well this one's only in the morning and the evening but like I said she does have evening homework sometimes to take a little while and then it just takes up I don't know but yeah I'm gonna finish this soon today's today's day 22 which means I have 18 days left and what else is going on? Oh, guess what I did yesterday? I went for a run. Was it fun? Yes. Was it painful? Yes. Was it doable? I did it, so I guess it was doable. But the only thing is, um, I posted this on Instagram, but anyways, I'll repeat it for you guys if you're not on Instagram. And why are you not on Instagram? Hmm, strange. But um, yeah, I started off slow. I did catch the 5K, which is what I did. When I first started to begin running, like when I started doing races, I think my first my first 5K was Coogan's. That was the best race ever. But anyways, I digress. So I started doing that. I did it yesterday. I woke up. I literally was like a kid on the first day of school. I woke up so... Get down from there. Hold on. Baby Zen. No, no. Come here. Oh, sorry. Live TV. Um, so... Yes, I started it yesterday. Now he's walking behind me. I started it yesterday and I did day one, which is five minute warm up, 90 seconds of walking, and 60 seconds of running. And you do that for six rounds. First round, I felt a twinge of pain, but I pushed through it. And um, second round, I think that's the round that was painful. Third round, I just, when she said run now, I, I tried, I did, I took the step to run and it was not happening, so I just stopped. And then the fourth, fifth, and sixth were on and off, on and off. I think the fifth and sixth, I did the six, the 60 seconds. It was painful, but I knew it was coming to an end, so I just tried to do as much as I can. Um, I want to try tomorrow. I heard it's going to be raining in the morning. Hopefully not. If it's not raining in the morning, I want to go back out again. I'm actually going to switch out the insoles of my sneakers to see if that helps with the impact when I hit the floor. Also, I want to... This is so weird. Also, uh, don't you dare go in front of the camera. Every single time. Uh, what else? Oh, and also I'm going to use... You really can sit there. This is what's happening. Hey! Oh my god, you're so rude. Come on. Come on, mama's tape it. Well, you're in the middle. And then I want to um, put KT tape on my ankle to see if that helps. I'm talking to people. You can't put your butt in the screen. Sorry. Um, what else is happening? Oh, god. 
worst transition ever with a butt in your face but all right a month ago i was contacted by neil cell they do vitamins chewables and they wanted me to write a review and do a giveaway on their biotin burst i believe they are i always say this wrong acai berry acai berry right or yeah acai berry anyways if you don't know about biotin it is found in certain foods it helps support strong nails hair and beautiful skin i was i'm always hesitant to review things gotta be honest because i don't i hate giving people bad reviews and i'd rather just not mention the company if i don't like the product but um they were really cool though so they basically told me just be honest and I tried it, it tastes so good. And honestly, I wanted to eat more than one once a day, but I, I stuck to the program. I take, I used to, well I still do, but I stopped when I did this. I usually take biotin pills, but in order to keep this review honest, I stopped taking them for the month that I was taking these. And I've noticed when I did take these, like it's been, I started on February 17th, today is March 16th, and my nails usually they are very bent uh, you guys can't see but my nails are very bendy and they've gotten stronger since I started taking these as well and I have like since I have PCOS my hair sheds a lot like, especially when I'm taking a bath or a shower and I like I wash my hair my comb always has a lot of hair in it for the past month I did notice that they are I made a point to look at the bottom of like the bathtub like okay it's not so bad so I did see those results and I relaxed my hair so it's easy for me to see if my hair gets longer because I get like new like curly new hair growth and I did get that so which means I have to relax my hair again but whatever it's cool because I have healthy nails as you can tell my hair is getting longer um what else and less shedding skin i really it's hard for me to really write a review about that because like i drink a lot of water and stuff so like my skin is pretty clear so but it looks good so it's still looking nice so, so yeah anyways i want to give you one of these well actually the people on neo cell are going to give it to you i'm just hosting the giveaway they're awesome enough to give one of my lucky readers a pack of 30 which will last you a whole month um all you gotta do is enter my giveaway it is not on this youtube page you have to head over to my website namastemadi.com in the bottom of the post i have all the rules for the giveaway as always it is only open to u.s residents at the moment i'm sorry my canadian friends but i'm sorry that's just the way it is sometimes look to u.s i'm joking don't you yeah, guys have free health insurance now, so why would you do that? God, Monday morning rambles. I love it. I do. Oh, I think Workout Wednesday is coming back this week just because I did a really good um, leg workout and I want to share it with you guys. So I think I'm going to record that. I might even record it right now after this, but but then I have the same clothes on, so that's just weird. And But Rosie says we can do it, so I don't know. Did you notice me and Rosie are wearing red headbands? Did that on purpose. Wow. I just admitted that. Anyways, all right. I'm going to go. Please enter my giveaway. You're going to love these. Make sure something, store them in the fridge once you open it because these are, what do they say? It says cold press, I believe it is. Yeah, they're so good though. Man, I'm kind of sad that they're almost finished, but what you going to do? Delicious delicious all right i'm gonna go have an awesome day and as always namaste my loves bye